Indian Trader 8.0.21.0 is out with 74 new fixes and 9 new features and one of them is actually pretty huge and will probably affect about 90% of you. So we're going to jump right in after this but don't forget to slap that like button and support the channel by subscribing. If you want to see any of our future videos whack that bell and we'll make sure that you get alerted to each one of them. Seven five four. Now, this is probably one of the biggest improvements NinTrader has done to date. I'm sure a lot of you are going to like this, but when you type in a symbol, you're going to get a list showing you the most common instruments that have anything to do with what you're typing in. It's also great for new traders because when you type in, for example, the CL and you don't know the contract uh, month and year or you don't know the right format, you can just type in CL and it's going to pull up the most uh, current one for you. 13492. Now you have a simple selection box that will allow you to hide or show your account numbers and balances. Uh, they get started out if you don't want to see them, so that is now an option for you. 13057 basically allows you to force a password to be entered every time you connect to Ninja Now, some of you might find this annoying. But for others who might uh, have a machine that's used by multiple people, um, they might not want uh, that ability for someone to just connect to that account without being able to enter in a password. So more or less just a security uh, feature uh, that was added into 8.0.21.0. 14228 so a bit of an odd situation uh, but was hit quite often as you were loading additional workspaces so if you were to load a workspace and then while it was loading you close a chart on your existing workspace this is thrown an error but that error has now been fixed bearish 14203 14252 14273 14305 14247 14257 all had to do with bugs that were fixed with Bearish. TD Ameritrade, so ETP I'm not going to go into all of them. But if you do use TDA, this would be an upgrade you're probably going to want to do pretty soon. 14262. So the description of this bug that was fixed was uh, pretty interesting. So I'm going to read it word by word. It says, reloading bars could intermittently result in a crash. Okay, so that is very vague. I would imagine based off that description, a ton of people would have hit this. So I think it's pretty important to point out that this issue has now been fixed. 14241. So when you use the market analyzer and you added an instrument to a blank row, sometimes you might have gotten an error. So that bug has now been fixed. Now, there was nothing earth shattering about this release. I'd say the biggest one was probably that UI change. But if you want us to keep doing these summary videos for Ninja Trader releases, please do let us know by hitting that thumbs up button. We like to know that you guys actually enjoy these. And feel free to download our free news and Priceline tools for the NT platform. It's our gift to you. So any questions, please let me know in the comments below and I'll get back to each and every one of you.